Leo. Leo, Leo, Leo. Uh, Zodiac star signs. Um, I've got some light codes for you, Leos. Um, welcome to my channel. Um, so monthly checking in with Leo. See what's going on with your energy. Um, and uh, if there's any light codes and guidance, please, please sort of bring in for the highest good for our Leos that are watching here in this now moment. So I'm just going to check in with Leo's energy. It's, you're on a lower ebb. You're on a lower ebb. So you're on a lower ebb. Thank you. Alagiana makusha makia. Ilagiana da isiangia da da bashono kodogono makusha makia tam. But there's a sense of stubbornness about you. <laughs> there's a sense of stubbornness about you with the right and wrong and the wherefores and the maybes. Um, for those that aren't doing their inner work, okay, if you feel that you are stuck and you are blaming others, you need to look at yourself, Leo, okay? If you're expansive and you're really flowing with it, Fabulous, you've done your work. There's, it's like extremities between you, Leos. It's like if you've done your spiritual work um, and you're going in inner work, you're going like, yeah, I'm expensive. Uh, if you're not, you're going like, crampy, crampy. And you're condensing yourself in a little box. Oh, that's horrible. That's it's 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 not a good it's not a good space to be in when you feel that you're trapped within a box. And this is the sort of energy that um, is going to be there to assist the Leos that feel that they're in a box, okay? Because when we can see ourselves in the box, then we can look around the box. Um, and it doesn't take much to do by looking in a small box. If there's an expansive Leo, then Leo is expansive and you just are, okay? If you're in a box, you can look around each of the corners, ins and outs, whips, upside downs, um, in the box. It's, it doesn't take much. There's not much that you, you know, it's like obvious stuff, Leo. It's like obvious stuff. It's like there. Like, oh, I just don't know what it is. Ah, there it is. It's that energy, okay? If you if you're not seeing it, you're denying it. Okay, in November you're going like, no, I can't see it. <laughs> you just walk around with like blinkers, like horses blinkers. It's been a, a, a quite a common thread running through these um, uh, star signs um, you know, today and yesterday when I was doing some filming with this. Is that it's very much. Um, uh, pushing through the mind of expectation and moving into flow okay uh, you know, even just watching this video you're like oh what's happening what's happening yeah, it's, it's all right because we all do it <laughs> i do it all the time get my tarot deck out watch a few videos yeah yeah it's fun it's fun to do that but as we go into a higher vibe and we're more connected, we just have a sense of being. So from a human perspective of mind, we're in our emotional states and stickiness. We feel into that, and then you're like, ew, it's obvious, it's obvious, it's obvious. Expanding out, and you can say like, it's obvious, it's obvious, it's obvious, and you do something about it. But when you're in the stickiness of it, you're trapped, you feel trapped, okay. It's like some of you would have left, uh, lost a spark of inspiration behind if you're in this box situation of this polarised um, opposition of your brightness. If you're in your box, you've lost your spark. It's very dark in there. It's not very nice at all. And, but when you're out, it's like very yin yang. It's very like expansive, white or black. White or black. Okay. Deep realizations, please. And act upon it. But act upon it after December. Okay. Act upon it after December. So, like, you see it. Okay, we're saying don't act upon it just yet, act upon it next year. Okay, now, this is the time for great change for Leo next year. 
they're, they're giving it over here even if you're expansive it's next year not now <laughs> not now not now you can see it you're like ah uh, uh, okay so take it up higher then see it then make your changes in in next year okay done Good advice. Thank you. Because if you act upon it now, or if you've already acted upon it, um, there will be a lot of upheaval, a lot of trauma and just created from it, a, a, a bit of a karmic loop that might occur actually as well for you. So settle in it. You know, November, December, you're coming up to Christmas, you're moving through the autumn, winter, you know, the, into winter. Um, just sit with it, stay with it, but it's like put out hooks into knowing what you can do for 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 January, uh, for January, February time, more sort of going into spring, and uh, But you will get out your black box. Just know this, all right, because you're being assisted and guided, and um, and supported through the journey. But you, it's seeing it in the first place. That's the thing. Uh, no, no, I can yeah, it's fine. <laughs> no, it's really quite, it's quite sweet, really, but it's not if you're in it. <laughs> so um, I'm not belittling your experience by any shape or means. I've, you know, I've been there, done that. <laughs> okay. And I'll still go through it now and again. Okay, so we all do. But the duality perspective, if you're shiny, shiny, bright, bright, you're shiny, then allow yourself to just shine, shine, shine all the way through, all the way through it. It's like people be coming in for this information and that information and you're exploding and expanding and you're shiny, shiny, shiny Leo. So uh, a typical Leo, like, like huh, Leo, do you watch me? That energy, absolutely, if you're shiny, shiny um, in your white, expansive um, mode rather than in your little black box so big polarities for for leo uh during the next couple of months november uh december yeah interesting thank you any codes please ah okay let's just sort of see if there's anything for for regardless they're saying regardless of the polarity of um experience whether you're up high flying high as a kite or whether you're in your little black box these codes will assist the heart Okay, thank you. So push through the mind. That will assist the subconscious heart. The greater knowing will come forward 
in the spring, an inspirational spark that allow that growth to come back in for those in the black box and a greater knowing for those that are on their outward ebb of expansion as the expansion sometimes takes a slight implosion for inspiration to come in rather than keep pushing forward if you are in your light always return back inward because a Leo tends to go off piste <laughs> so draw it back in if you are expanding right now in certain moments to just clarify rather than just going off in the direction that the mind perceives it to be going in just keep checking back in with your hearts okay regardless of what perspective we're talking about here so if you are expanding leo just keep coming back center because you do have a tendency to go off piste <laughs> okay thank you i like you and i did this year so all is well, thank you. So I do hope that these codes and advice helps you through this following month of November or in the time pocket of now when you're actually listening to these um, recordings. So um, check out all the details below, like and subscribe and su comment below. Let me know, let me know if you're in your little black box or if you're expanding, but just check in with yourself as you as you are. Just ground yourself a little bit with that expansion also. It will assist you. It will assist you on your journey. So take care everyone and I'll see you all soon. Take care. Bye-bye.